first Detroit Kennel Club bench dog show was held in April of 1916. There were four judges and catalogs cost just 25 cents. A lot has certainly changed since then, but the celebration of dogs remains the same. Next weekend, the 106th and 107th Detroit Kennel Club dog shows will be at Cobo Center downtown. And joining me is pet therapist and dog handler Terry Saracino and seven-year-old Sassy, who I've been falling in love with. It took no time at all. <laughs> Thanks so much for being here. You're welcome. First of all, tell us what benched dog shows are. Uh, a bench dog show means that um, the people that are showing the dogs and the handlers have to be in their benched area, and it goes by breed from 10 a.m. until 5 p.m., and we're not allowed to leave our area. I mean, they can, you know, go out and relieve themselves, but they have to be back in the ring because, or in the benched area, because the people want to come, exhibitors, which are us, and visitors, which are you, are going to want to come and talk to me and find out a little bit more about the breed. So that's what we're there for. So they can come throughout the day and you'll be there in the same spot. Oh, yes. <laughs> I believe the doors open at 9 a.m., showing starts at 9, goes till 5, and then uh, uh, best in show starts at six o'clock in the evening so it's quite interesting if you've never seen it I bet tell us about sassy here she has been shown before but not this time yes yeah, she's though. got seven points on her she's pretty much retired from the ring right now but we will be there um, with the therapy dogs um, Children's Hospital of Michigan will be down there their therapy dogs will be there um, I'm actually the president of Dr. Paws and um, our group will be down there also um, and she really enjoys doing the therapy work with the patients visiting the hospitals and the nursing homes and and people come down to ask about how to get started with that also. There's a lot of things you can do with your dog. And she is just a beauty and so incredibly mellow. I swear, I've never met a dog so mellow. Well, My it's also like this. how you work with them, yeah. too. You know, so there'll be trainers down there. There's going to be agility. You'll see some, you know, um, some wonderful things. Uh, kids can get involved. There's junior handling. Um, there's some great shopping, uh, which is what I like. Um, but there's all kinds of things. And if you've never been, you've got to go get there early, stay as long as you can. As, as you can see here, I'm an avid fan of uh, the Kennel Club. Um, these are all my catalogs, and these are a great oh, point of reference. Yeah. Right. People call me and say, I need a uh, breeder for a um, Bichon. Um, so I'll look up something in here, or I'll go to the Bichon Club of Michigan. Mm -hmm. um, so, you know, people go to the dog shows because they're looking for a dog. But we really emphasize to please do your homework. Do not just run out and go on the Internet and go in the newspaper. Um, go to the dog show, meet a breeder, talk to them. If they don't have time to talk to you, get their business card. And, um, you know, call them later when they have time that you can sit down and actually talk to them. And this is something that's really competitive. What are they looking for when they are looking at these dogs? Uh, well, they're looking for a dog that is in top condition. And if you just watch Westminster, you'll see mm -hmm. some of those yes. dogs are pretty pampered pooches. Yeah. <laughs> um, but um, they're looking at coat. They're looking at structure. They're looking to see how um, close to the standard of the breed that that dog is. And the judge is going to go over them, is going to look at movement and, and just about everything. Sounds like it's something for, for everyone. Families it's, can come and really have a good time. Never, there's search and rescue. There's all kinds of things. And there's actually some of the adoption agencies might be there, too. Wonderful. So, Thank you so much for welcome. being here, along with wonderful Sassy here. So <laughs> Sweet. Tickets are $15 for adults and $8 for children. Kids under two get in for free. The fun starts at 9 o'clock and the Best in Show will go into the ring at about 6 on Saturday and Sunday evening. We'll have a link to the details on